So here's a great technique if you're someone that feels like you've got like blockages in your body, okay? Do you ever wake up sometimes and you've got like a really heavy heart? Do you feel like sometimes like your lungs just feel so blocked, okay? And you don't have a clue why, or you feel like you've got loads of dense energy and stuff, okay? All right? So I'm just going to show you something that I did with my inner child group work um, this morning. I do it every two weeks with these people, all right? And all I want you to do is I want you just to talk to your pain, okay? Because actually your pain has the answers, all right? So let's say you've got a broken heart, or let's say you've got pain in your heart, okay? All I want you to do is this. Put your hand wherever your pain is, so say it's on your heart, your lungs, your stomach, wherever, okay? Tune into your heart. And as you picture your heart, is your heart sad? Is it happy? What is it telling you? What is it saying? Is it anxious? Is it depressed? What is it, okay? And as you tune into that, I want you to imagine that you've got a beautiful, gorgeous green crystal under this hand here, okay? And I want you to know that the faster you spin that crystal, the more heat that is generated. Okay, and just allow that crystal just to go around for a little bit, okay? And then as you're tuning into your heart, okay, focusing on in there, the green crystal spinning, what number starting to come in your head? Okay, you want one between zero and ten. Ten being the happiest your heart has ever been in your whole entire life, okay? Could be when you fell in love, for example, okay? Um, or zero being you're so upset, you're so sad, you haven't got a clue what you want to do in your life, okay? So just tuning into that, what number am I getting? Okay, for me today, eight, nine is what I've got, okay? But I can tell you there's times I've got zero, you know, one or two, all right? But as you're just tuning in there, and I want you to imagine that crystal is spinning faster and faster and faster. Okay. And I want you to imagine that it starts to spin in like a diamond form. Okay. And I want you to imagine that it's just clearing out all this sludge and murky bits and pieces, okay, in your heart. All right. And then I want you to imagine that this sludge needs pulling out. Okay. And as you start to pull this out, okay, what you can do is you can also get your phone, okay, and you could put it on voice recorder. Okay, and you could record whatever you're pulling out of your heart, okay? And as you're pulling out of your heart, okay, and you're tuning into it, is there a shape that's coming to mind in your heart, okay? Is it like a rectangle? Is it a box? Because if it's a box, you've got stuff that you've got to unpack and let go of, okay? But as you're pulling that out, okay, is there a colours that you're starting to pull out of your body, okay? Are there any colours? Remember, colours correspond to your chakras, okay? And as you're pulling that out, okay, are there any memories that you're starting to pull and let go of, okay? And then turn it into faster. What am I letting go of as I'm pulling it out, okay? If you're doing it in your lungs, okay? What is coming out of my lungs, all right? And then what you can do is you need to start breaking it up. So if nothing's coming out in memories, okay, we can pattern ourselves. This is our somatic system. Pattern on ourselves, very much like EFT, okay? EFT is amazing, okay? But actually, you can just pat yourself wherever, okay? So if I just did this with this lady just now, okay? I was just like, okay, pat on your lungs, what's coming? Okay, and if we're going to pattern our lungs, okay, let's keep our fingers really, you know, nice and wide, okay, that is, nothing's happening, so if you can, when you pattern on yourself, keep your fingers nice and wide, okay, what is coming up for me, alright, and just let that stuff go, because whilst it's great to cry, okay, sometimes we've got so much anger that we need to speak it, we need to say it, that's what made that platform and a technique video on Sunday, I'll link it back in here, okay, or if you're watching this on TikTok, please go and have a look at my profile, find the platform anger technique, it explains how to do it, okay. And as you're patting on yourself, let it go. Speak what you need to say. Who's coming in your mind that you really need to talk to, that you really need to say stuff to, okay? Because this is your opportunity. No one's watching, no one's listening. But let that anger go. Because I'm telling you this, keeping hold of anger is what causes us to be ill. It's what causes um, all of our aches and our pains and our issues. But if you talk to your pain, I promise you, your pain has an answer. Your pain has a story. Because your story is only ever formed from your belief. I hope that little bit of information really helps you. Let me know in the comments what's coming up for you. Or do you need to journal and do some more deep introspection work? Remember, if you believe it's possible to heal, I promise you, it really is. I am living proof. Have a brilliant day. Enjoy yourselves. And I'll catch you guys soon. Bye.